Are you tired of losing money trading cryptocurrencies? Sign up for my free trading AI with over 50% monthly return on your investment. Link is in the description. The price of SHIB has been struggling for a while now and the Shiba Inu community has been hoping for something to happen to turn the tide. Well it looks like that thing is finally here. At least that's what Shaitoshi thinks. It's a new Shiba Inu project and in this video we'll be talking about it and how it could send SHIB to the moon. Disclaimer just a couple of weeks ago, the Shiba Inu dev team announced that it had plans to develop and launch a Shiba Inu cold wallet. In subsequent weeks we got more information on what the cold wallet would be about. It would resemble a card and be specifically for the Shiba Inu ecosystem, but it would also support thousands of other cryptocurrencies and NFTs. One of the things that we didn't know though was when exactly the wallet would be launched. And considering how long we had and still have to wait for the launch of Sherbarium, many people did not expect the cold wallet to be launched anytime soon. Well, the wallet arrived early. Tandem, the Swiss-based blockchain firm that developed the wallet, hosted an AMA together with the Shiba Inu dev team yesterday. A presentation on the cold wallet was made during the AMA and Shiba Inu holders also had the opportunity to ask any questions they might have had on the cold wallet. Winners for the wallet giveaway were also announced. Yeah. For those who didn't know, the dev team was giving away 10 Shiba Inu wallets to people who completed a number of tasks. By now, those who won the giveaway would have been made aware. So congratulations to them. Pre-ordering the wallet went live yesterday by the way, and there are only 5,000 wallets available on pre-order. So if you want it, you have to get it now. Not financial advice though. Now if you decide to pre-order a SHIB wallet, you should know that delivery of wallets will not start until the beginning of July. Neither Tangum nor the SHIB dev team has said holders have to wait to get their wallets. But early July is just a couple of weeks away. It doesn't seem like that long a wait. However, you can share your thoughts on this in the comments section below. Meanwhile, according to the crypto, Basic proponents looking to leverage the early opportunity can head to the platform and initiate the pre-order. Notably, the cost of each Shiba Inu cold wallet, which comprises a set of three cards, goes for $77.70. This does not include shipping costs users can pay with crypto assets or fiat currencies. Do you think the price is fair? And would you be buying some SHIB wallets yourself? Let me know in the comments section. That said, no one knows why the dev team managed to launch this wallet early, but could it maybe have something to do with the recent Ledger controversy? If you have been watching videos on this channel, you know that Ledger recently launched an update that made people lose confidence even withdrawing all their coins from their Ledger wallet. So could it be possible that Shiba Inu is trying to corner the market that Ledger just lost? I mean, it makes a lot of sense. The Ledger issue is pretty recent barely a couple of days. So there are still a lot of people who recently pulled out their cryptocurrencies from their ledger wallet and are looking for an alternative called wallet. This means that the Shiba Inu wallet probably couldn't have been launched at a better time. Provided Shiba Inu has learned from ledger's mistakes, this new wallet should be able to attract a good number of those people. Now, the reason we want all of these people deciding to hold their cryptocurrencies in the Shiba Inu wallet is because of the potential it holds for the price of SHIB. And right now, Shiba Inu needs all the help that it can get with its price. If I've said it once, I've said it a million times, that Shiba Inu has been battling with its price for a couple of weeks now. Now, dropping that zero that it picked up seems to be an uphill task. That said, there have been some rays of hope since the launch announcement. For one, the 24 hours trading volume increased by close to 3%, which could be a direct effect of the wallet, causing more people to be interested in Shiba Inu. Or as Coin Edition put it, this increased trading volume during a slump implies that traders are still actively buying and selling SHIB, taking advantage of the price drop. There's no way to know for sure if the launch of the Shiba Inu wallet would have a positive impact on the price of SHIB. However, if we are to go by precedent, there is a significant possibility of this happening. New products usually inject a sense of excitement into the community enough to spark an increase in purchase. So, provided the community is not completely jaded, this could happen. If you found this really valuable, please drop a comment 
and share this video with friends. It really helps with the YouTube algorithm, thus helping me to keep increasing the quality of the videos. Not only that, Shibarium's success could also contribute to this price pump. In fact, Sherbarium might be Shiba Inu's last chance at a price redemption. The ecosystem has tried other things, including promoting the asset and trying to carry out burns, but nothing has worked well so far. And while it is logical for burns to result in a price increase, it hasn't happened yet because there just haven't been enough burns. Enter Sherbarium. According to Watcher Guru, Sherbarium is set to become a hub for various developments including a decentralized exchange, metaverse and games built on Ethereum specifically for the Shiba Inu blockchain. The DEX on Sherbarium will empower users to trade SHIB and other tokens in a fully decentralized manner. Through this, it will slash the need of relying on a centralized exchange. Since this will be built on Shiba Inu, it could lure investors into the SHIB market. The fact that Sherbarium will offer incentives to users is another reason people might be attracted to the ecosystem. SHIB holders will be able to stake on Shibarium and earn rewards as a result, which is attractive to many. This could also drive up demand for SHIB tokens, as people look to purchase as many tokens as they can in order to properly benefit from placing stakes. There's also the fact that Shibarium will burn tokens without people having to spend extra money. Every transaction on the platform will burn SHIB, which means that people don't have to do anything extra to burn tokens on SHIB. In addition, considering that the test platform has completed millions of transactions so far, it is probably safe to say that a lot of burns will be happening on Shibarium when it is launched. Meanwhile, just the anticipation for Shibarium has been driving engagement for SHIB. Lunar Crash, the platform that tracks the social engagements of crypto projects, just released a top 10 list of assets with the highest social engagements. SHIB made it to the list thanks to over 7 billion social media engagements in the past 30 days. This is a 25.2 increase in social engagements over the past month. Finally, Shiba Inu isn't the only token in the ecosystem that is currently on a rally bonus up to. The governance token for Sherbarium just made a 25% rebound rally as its market cap increased recently. According to DailyCoin, Shiba Inu's alternative token records, 25% weekly gains 46% in the money signal indicates that over 10% more current bone holders are making a profit at this price. As a result, bone reached a $204 million market cap on Monday, picking up $40 million in the last seven days. But bone is still not back at $1. But with the way that it has been crawling back up, it might hit that $1 sooner than SHEB would drop a zero. Analysts say that the token is gearing up to restore another crucial support level. If the current bullish trend continues, we might see more price pumps with bone before Sherbarium launches. But what seems more? Certain is having the price of a bone pump as people start using Sherbarium when it gets launched. Bone is kind of the native token for Sherbarium. After all, People need it to carry out transactions and to serve as validators or delegators. So we should see more people purchasing bones once the Sherbarium is launched. With that, we come to the end of this video. If you enjoyed the video, then please like this video and don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section. This really helps me with the YouTube algorithm. Also, please share this video to as many people as possible. Let's get this news out there.